All right, this is Nick Unnerved, and we are back in Once Human. All right, so I thought I'd do a little video on my final thoughts on this game. The the uh, beta test is uh, coming to a close here in a few days. Uh, well, really, there's like, uh, I think it's on the 21st of January. Um, and today is the 14th. Uh, so, I still have seven days, I guess, uh, left to play this, but I'm pretty much at an end. Um, we have made it to level 47. Um, I've done every stronghold in the game. Uh, you can watch my videos uh, on that if you like. Um, I've, I've cleared every stronghold in the game. Um, the only thing I haven't done, <clears throat> um, I, I haven't done any of the bosses on hard difficulty. Also haven't done like this world event. I haven't done, um, LEA research lab, um, yet, but everything else I've pretty much done. Um, I haven't done really any of the PVP stuff. I'm not necessarily into PVP. I'm more of, uh like a PVE type. I like quests, you know, and stuff like that. So, uh, kind of keep that in mind as we discuss my final thoughts on the game. Now, um, as far as gear goes, um, you know, I was running the Black Panther, um, the Div Evo. I was using the Beret um, for the Shrapnel. Um, I've got the uh, four-piece agent set, and I was using these boots uh, for the Fortress Warfare thing. Nothing crazy. Um, you know, I just had some basic mods on that stuff. I have um, a couple of blueprints that I haven't uh, unlocked the weapons on that I found. Um, uh, in the game, you know, I probably wouldn't use them anyway, so, um, <clears throat> so to, uh, some of the stuff I like, this, you know, this game was pretty fun, uh, in this beta test, it runs really well, I, the game crashed, like, twice on me, and I, I got into the beta, um, like, three days after they opened it up, so I've been playing, you know, been playing it most of the time. The beta uh, content has been available. These the devs on this game have really been putting in a lot of effort to fix bugs and update the game. Just about every time I have logged into this game, there's been an update uh, ready to download. Um, some of the stuff I like, you know, there's plenty of stuff to do in the lower levels. Okay, so. Um, the map for the, the first 20 levels really is pretty dense with stuff to do. Uh, all these places are relatively close together. Um, there's little side missions, like over here by the hospital, there was like a, you walk up and there was a little guy and, you, you know, that just triggered when you were near the area and you had a little side quest for you to do. Um, there was a lot more puzzles and in-depth in kind of PvE stuff in the lower levels. Um, but, which was really great. Um, I enjoyed that quite a bit. Um, as we got into the, uh, mid-twenties, um, the map started thinning out quite a bit. Um, once we got over here into Chalk Peak in the in the level 30 to 40 range, I mean, there's just it starts to get really thin uh, with stuff. There's not a whole lot to do over here, and then once you start getting in the end game stuff, it's just nothing. Um, there's hardly any quests. There's hardly any bounties. Nothing up here. Um, it it's just they need. And I really hope that by the time this game comes out, they fill this out some. There's still some area out here that they that obviously isn't available yet um, that they, you know, can fill in. Hopefully that'll be ready by release. But, you know, really I hope that they 
fill in this area, qu these two areas, quite a bit. They're, you know, they could add quite a bit more. Another suggestion, I would hope that they would add more, you know, puzzles and things to do. Uh, the puzzles in the early game were really nice. Uh, they were intuitive. Um, you know, they had some interesting concepts and stuff there. I like being able to walk up on a stronghold area and and have like a random npc asking for something to do that would be nice if they could fill out a lot of this uh a lot of these strongholds with that because you know by the time you know you're doing these you know in the early game you know it's all the same you know go to a stronghold find the mysterious chest find a couple weapons crate kill a few enemies you know, and that's pretty, that's okay for a little while, but it really starts to get old after a little bit. I mean, it's really repetitive. And it's nice to have, like, a little side quest as you're coming into one of these. Have some sort of NPC that asks you to gather some special stuff or save another NPC or something like that. That would be really great. Also, in the town hubs, it would be nice that, to be able to have some quests out of there that you can grab. I know in the lower levels there are, and there's the bounty tasks with the T-Man guy. They just need way more of it, um, you know, aside from your daily stuff, which is, you know, typical MMO daily quest kind of crap, um, which is great, you know, and they're good for XP and all that, so that's nice, but... It'd be cool to have some, like, story NPCs more scattered around the map and stuff. Um, that would be really awesome. Um, but once you get up into the late game, it's just nothing but a gear grind. Everything is so spread out. Um, there's really just nothing to do. You know, that's why I'm still level 47. I have hardly played in the last week. Um, it's just I'm in the gear grind phase. And to be honest, I'm bored with it. There's just really nothing to do but run around and get weapons chests, you know. Or, you know, since I'm high enough level, I could join a war band and do some PvP. But that's going to, for me, that's going to get old really quick. I know a lot of people love that, you know. And that's a big aspect of this game I'm sure a lot of people love. A lot of the other content creators out there are all about it and talking about it, you know, and I've watched some other guys stream it and, and, you know, it looks fun, but you know, that's going to, for me, that's going to get old really quick. You know, the engaging story and stuff, um, is going to, would be a lot better for me, you know, and what I like to do when it comes to kind of MMOs and, and, uh, PVE content. Um, but overall, I think this game is really fun. Uh, I did like it quite a bit. I spent a lot of time in it, um, running around and doing the stuff. There's a lot of stuff, you know, especially in the lower zones to do. Um, you know, uh, it's just after a little bit, you know, grinding the, the gear, grinding for stardust, you know, uh, you can do the purification things for that. But I, I like, personally, I like going down here and raiding these uh, encampments, these things. Coming in and, and raiding this stuff is pretty fun. Um, but overall, you know, um, it has some great mechanics. Um, the, the gameplay is really fun. Um, the gunplay is pretty nice. Uh, the building and stuff is really great. I really like that. Uh, there's a few things that... I think could be updated there as well but you know for the most part the building is really intuitive really easy you know I just wish that you weren't capped to like um, for instance if you see at the top there you can only have so many structures which is m way more than enough um, furniture and all that but the power generation part of it is just we need it needs some more there i mean it really holds you back unless you're in a war band or something like that um uh i've heard with or i saw with the with the high base stuff that you know you get there's a whole mechanic where you can get more space you know more uh power generation 
and stuff like that. I mean, still limited to an extent, but, you know, um, it is a bit, gives a bit more options. But overall, man, I, I do recommend this game. I think it's going to be pretty good. Um, of course, when it comes out uh, later this year, uh, if they stick to their timeline, we will be jumping back into it and giving it another shot uh, for sure. Um, there's a few things with the... Um, uh, uh, where is it? Oh, wow. Well, my server is all the way uh, down here in the end. Um... Yeah, so we're, yeah, so I'm not in a war band. So, I mean, some of this stuff requires, oh, I'll take that. You got to come in here and collect this stuff. Uh, um, but anyway, so, you know, like I said, it, it just becomes a grind after a little while. And, you know, I, I do like a grind, but, you know, there is quite a bit um, more. So, in this, the only one I didn't find, I didn't find the wish manic I didn't, I don't like fishing in games, so I didn't even try for this. Uh, and I didn't, you get this one from LEA, so I didn't do that. I tried this one a couple of times, but it doesn't spawn enough in my server. Uh, it's over here. It pops up in a town over here somewhere. Um, I've seen it like maybe four or five times. And I mean, I've spent, you know, 10 hours a day in this game in some day, on some days. So, you know, I don't know. But anyway, uh, this is Nick. So that's pretty much my final thoughts on this game. Uh, I will be jumping back into it and making more content once the game releases. But right now, I'm just I'm pretty much bored with it. I'm done at the moment. So, um, you know. Uh, um, so let's uh, hopefully um, when it comes out, you know, let's all give it a try and and I think it's gonna be it's gonna be pretty good. Um, the devs are really, uh, doing a good job on this one. It looks nice and everything. So, um, those are pretty much my final thoughts. I, you know, uh, if you like the content, you know, please, uh, like and subscribe and all the good stuff and we'll see you next time.